Sure. Hello there from Galaxy's Edge yet again. I'm finally back. Took a bit of a over a week long break, but I'm finally back and my streak has obviously ended, but I'm back for the first time actually since I finished Crash of Fate. So it's kind of cool to be hanging out where Izzy and Jules once hung out. Over there is Oga's obviously, where Izzy and Jules were quite terrifyingly uh, Shanghai'd into helping Oga. But it's over here by the Falcon, where all their hijinks ensued, um, you know, with Onaka's transport solutions. So there's that, and here's where they ate. Chef Cookie. Cookie made him some pretty good grub over here at Dakime 7. And of course, Doc Ondar is one of the main, main little hangouts in the whole book. Of course, that's where Tap works, and that's where they found Doc in his shop. And there's Ronto Roasters, of course, where uh, Jules would often grab some Ronto wraps. So, it's just cool being here after I've uh, finally finished Crash of Fate. I still gotta read Black Spire. So, that'll be next on the reading list. And I'm gonna love that, because Vi is one of my favorite characters, so I can't wait to learn more about her. But, let's go ahead and go into Docs right now. Get a look at what's going on inside Docs. I guess they would be oh, I can. Alright, be gentle. Don't break the antiques. Oh my god. This shop is always crowded. Doc is doing some good business. This place is always full of people. Just look at all this stuff. I love it in here. Find something new every time you come in. I do understand why Brad loves it so much, how it's his favorite. That helps. Getting to see Doc helps. Everybody's favorite Ithorian. Wonder if he's got a Sabak set I can use. I, I know he's got some up there. Look, right? Right there's some Sabak cards. Doc. Doc, let me burn those off you. I got some Kyber crystals I can give you. Nah. Maybe? Yeah, he's kind of giving me the cold shoulder, so... He's a little busy. Understandable. Oh, he's getting a call about Ogus. I don't want to be uh, a part of that business venture, so I'm gonna get out of here real quick. But... Love looking around here. So much to do, so much to see. So... I'll head back out, but for now, I'm gonna leave it right here. I love living so close to the parks now, it's awesome. I got a fast pass for Slinky, so I flew here, just hopped in the car, took about an hour to get here, did Slinky. Obviously, I had to come back to Batu and hang out here for a while before I go back home. But the luxury of living so close, so I can basically come here on the weekends and just live, as they say, my best life. So, love it. Hopefully, uh, when Brad gets back from Disneyland, we can get some more podcast episodes. We can fly the Falcon a few more times. There is a galactic rumor floating around out there saying you can actually get three containers of coaxium. I've uh, attempted about 30-ish, give or take. I've lost count of times. So, in my 30 or so ventures, I have yet to collect more than two. Two has been the max that I can actually get, so I've heard conflicting reports from many smugglers across the galaxy saying that no, you can in fact only get two. First order will snuff you out before you can get more than two. And I have heard others say quite the opposite, that you can actually get three if you're kind of a, a Chewy or Han Solo level of smuggler, which I'm not there yet. I'm a as I like to say, one of the best engineers in the galaxy. That's easily my best position. I always get 100%. Um, so yeah, we'll try that a little bit later. I might go in and solo rider it now, so I'll leave it here. May the spires keep you, and I will see you all a little later.